नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट मून सन कॉम्बिनेशन नेक्स्ट मून सन कॉम्बिनेशन ओके राइट डाउन वेन मून इज इन द नक्षत्र ऑफ सन कॉमा कॉमा मीन्स और और when from the degree in which moon is the next graha the next graha that moon connects with kama meets is sun plus 2 or when moon is in the rashi of sun so which rashi when moon leo, is in the rashi leo. of sun leo that's it okay so a combination can be you have a moon here right and immediately you have a sun this is first right or you have moon in the nakshatras of sun so what are the nakshatras of sun can you tell me kritika uttara falguni and uttara shada so all of you who have the nakshatras you try and next is when moon is in simha rashi one by one you tell me see again you should also share sir this is correct that is correct right the more you share the more others would be encouraged right and this is what i do for a living so when i'm doing this for a living first i should be i i should be confident before teaching that to you so i know you know how this works but you also should share with excitement that is when other people will also get okay we are on right track okay number 1 mother Ma yeah somebody has a question mother will be very leadership qualities yeah very good very very good wonderful wonderful mother will will administer the household full leadership full leader of the house is mother number 2 the mother mother will be egoistic ah yeah 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 you can add you can add you can add first let me complete all this thing yeah after that you add okay first you write down one by one you write down yeah when you are predicting to somebody mother will be egoistic mother will be adamant next day he won't come to you okay first you should you should actually go about and use the right kind of words okay that's very very but number 2 mother will be near a temple see these are the high see in the this type of points is what you should actually come up with he will be like wherever mother is there will be a temple near number 3 right we are talking about mother here we are not talking about the person mother will be authoritative number 4 mother will be independent right number 5 mother will be charitable king always likes to give everything on charity right take this take that take this number 6 mother would be religious spiritual number 7 mother see sometimes if it is not the mother you should always say mother's side always say mother's side that's the safest route there would be people who go god frenzy god frenzy is what kama in tamil we use the word sami adidal so people in the southern part of india tamil nadu right sami adidal so suddenly you know taliyamman uh, durgai all that will come inside them and they will start dancing the easiest possession way, of god 
yeah possessed divinely possessed you know you you have this movie kantara so there will be a kantara in mother's family suddenly they will say woo that will be there mother's family right next number 8 government politics connection will be there mother itself will be a government servant she will be working or mother will be in politics mother counselor all this comes in this category at least you know what in her street she will be a known person so that quality will be there next two marriage ayya yeah, go ahead go ahead uh sir mother will be near temple means what sir it, it, how it is connected with any planet sun is temple ayya graha karakatva okay that, that i don't know that is why i am lacking somewhere don't worry it's okay it's okay it's okay everything is karakatva everything is karakatva don't worry. okay two marriages or gone as a second wife immediately don't tell like this you will get into trouble not trouble deep trouble you are telling about somebody's mother tell mother's side there will be two marriages or they would have gone as second wife they will shake their head from inside right in the mother's side right there would be women who would have gone as second wife or two marriages write down i will give you the logic will have great affection towards the father not your father her father mother's father mother will love her father will have bright appearance who mother will have big eyes so mother she'll be bright she will have big eyes like this you go and describe this is the style you should predict You'll be like where did this fellow see my mother where did this madam see my mother how is this sir predicting like this it's like as though he has come inside my house itself and seen my mother my mother is somewhere in you know somewhere in kerala somewhere in tirchi somewhere how does he know all this about my mother this is the way you should stun people see today evening somebody put a review one of the students i tell all students please don't come to me for a consultation i am here to teach you the reason i was not into teaching or social media is because throughout my life i am doing consultation where is the time to teach now i am into social media because whatever i am teaching one small portion i am putting in social media otherwise you know professionals we don't have time for social media in his review is writing this is my last consultation i was like you know what is this what did i do? basically what he is trying to tell is this is my last consultation here after i don't need any other astrologer but the way he has written the review is this is my last consultation starting itself I'm wondering what did i do wrong basically what he is trying to imply is i don't need anybody else my suggestion is you learn right because for students i always tell don't come to me for a consultation because consultations are always pre booked 4 weeks 3 weeks 5 weeks right so because i've been my regular clients they themselves pre book right so unnecessarily don't waste your hard earned money don't waste time you are learning what you are learning only i'm going to apply and tell you right so you will be able to stun your audiences stun your clients post office near your house so this is the way you should predict okay next next see number 13 mother will be famous see if you go to such person's house right usually what would they say rahul they will know your name or what would they know mr ram's son you are mr ram's son am i correct this is the way they can introduce but for those who have right a moon sun combination they won't know your name they won't know your father's name also you know who this boy is this is lakshmi akasan this is saraswati akasan they will only remember the mother's name why because mother will be a famous person in that area okay 
Number 14. Mother will lead. Somewhere she will have a leadership role, sir. Ma'am, somewhere she will have a leadership role. Some role she will be. Society, community, street, somewhere, temple, whatever. One role should be given to her. It will come to her. Right? Number 15. Will have knowledge about medicine. Immediately, it does not have to mean that every person who has this combination, the mother has to be a doctor. But small, you know, small, somebody, you know, small problem also, they would tell, you know, put this medicine, go to this doctor. For this, this is the doctor. This is the medicine. This is the ointment. They will tell that. Right? So see the order in which I am actually creating the prediction. Right? Mother will be a bright. See, start like this. Mother. She will be a bright, sir. Your mother will be a bright person. Mother will have big eyes. She will be authoritative. In your house, mother is only controlling everything. Am I correct? All this you start. Your mother only takes care of all the expenses. Your father does not take care of the expenses. Somewhere your mother will be involved with some party, community, something. That involvement will be there. At least in that street, there she will have some position. Whichever street, whichever colony, whichever apartment you are, some role she will have. All this is for moon, sun. Right? Now, now, this is for you now. For those who have this combination. What is moon? Moon is your mind. Moon is your mind. He is the manasa or manokarka. Right? Write down number 17. So, what are the thoughts which will go inside your mind? See, moon is the mind. Sun, it indicates, you know, your subconscious. Why? Because he is the Kala Purusha's fifth bhava. Your subconscious is reflected by the sun. So, moon is the mind. It is connected with the sun here. So, what will be in your mind? What will be in your subconscious? Number 17. You will have thoughts of love and romance because sun is romance. Immediately don't go to Venus, Shukra and all that. Sun. Creativity starts with the fifth bhava. Love starts with the fifth bhava. Next. Number 18. Number 18. Artistic thoughts. Number 14. Astrology. Government. Politics. Spirituality. Right? All of this will be there within one's mind. See, for all those who have this moon-sun combination, somewhere this thought will be around Politics, government, spirituality, religion, right? Astrology, share market. Number 20. Number 20. <clears throat> will like, will like praises, flattery. In Tamil we say, Adi kedi appa thundu pootu turukkunu yungilukk. Which means, see, one person, one time you can tell Namaste. 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 Why every time you have to tell Namaste to these type of people. Flattery. <laughs> will be passionate about, will be passionate about arts. Either they will like to watch cinema. One after another they will watch one cinema. Or they will want to go to the cine field also. This thing. Okay. So this is the... yeah. See, we have a question from... See, there are some questions. So, so there, is a, there is a student who wants to share. Please share. Go ahead. Student has shared something on the chat. Okay. What is the concept of second marriage here? The ninth bhava indicates the father of the Kala Purusha. Right? Of the Kala Purusha, ninth bhava indicates the father. Which is the ninth ninth? Which is the ninth ninth? Fifth. Yep. So automatically, something to do with two marriages. Mostly, if you see, mostly, if you see, what happens is, for those who have Uttara Falguni Nakshatra, Kritika Nakshatra, 
Uttarashada nakshatra. If you see, somebody has to go on mute. Please go on mute. Please go on mute. Somebody wants to share something? Go ahead. Questions? Go ahead. Okay. Please take the points. Points are extremely important. Questions you can keep asking, right? If you see too many grahas in what? Uttara Falguni, Kritika, Uttarada Nakshatra, Sun's Nakshatra, right? Immediately you can say there are two marriages in this family. This is a rule, right? See, some of you, you will say that, you know what? Not even one line is missing. Was the purpose of teaching you all this not to make 100 out of 100? We should at aspire towards that. One or two points is fine. See, in this world today, where you are, where you are, where where you learn, 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 still, you know, to get five points itself is difficult. I'm telling you, one or two points maximum only will go miss. That is what, I'm, and that too, you know, if you have more than that points also, it will be connected with another rule. But concept is clear. Next. Then may I say something? Sure, sure ma'am. Go ahead. Then my uh, daughter, though she is very young, she is uh, Uttarashada born. And okay. I can really, I was really laughing when I was writing all the things. I mean, most mm. of the things are matching with me. Mm. Except for being authoritative and uh, like taking leadership. Mm. Um, because my husband stays too busy. So mm. that is the reason that I have to look after and cater the responsibilities of home more mm. than him. Hmm. And uh, other than that, leadership still, I am not into any role as for now. But I'm, I can vouch. I mean, everything. How, everything. How old are you, ma'am? 80, 80, 80, 80, 82. Yes, 82? I had. Am I audible? Yes, yes, yes audible. Probably, I, I know. Ma'am, ma'am, how old are you? You are seventy-two years, eighty-two years, ninety-two years, ma'am. Still yeah. forty also. So there's lot of time to go on, ma'am. <laughs> you will yes, get yes, sir. Hmm. but I was laughing like rule anything. I mean, bang on. Yes, rule bang is rule. on predictions. Before and you before you go out, all this rule has to come. That is that. Okay. Anybody else? See, so this is one. The the other point you can do is you know, mother will see this is like you know, it is not a great point, actually. See, you can also write this down. Mother. So we are referring to the mother here only. We will like to collect ornaments. Now, is this a unique point? Which woman, which three does not like ornaments? All women like ornaments. But son, Abharna. So that thing will be there. Next. What is this um, thing about God frenzy? Or what we call as Sami Adubadu in Tamil. See here. See if you go to a temple. Right. What will we do? You will you'll pray to, you know, whichever temple you are going to, uh, Venkateshwara temple, you are going to Murugan temple, you will you will go there, you, you will pray there, two, five minutes, you will pray, then they will give you some sundal, they will give you some prasadam. Sundal is what? Channa. You know, something. You know, some prasadam they will, you will eat and come. This is the maximum you will do in a temple. See, what if you go to a temple and you are looking at the God straight like this, continuously for 15 minutes, what will happen? What will happen? Immediately forget about, you know, whether you are spiritual or not. People around you, they will immediately think you are possessed. Then in the temple, they will have these instruments, right? You know, they will have this, the temple drum, they will have all this. They will start. They will just try it. Go to a temple. 15 minutes, just stand still and keep looking at God. Next person who is standing next to you, he will come or she will come and say, Guruji, he will say, Guruji, Samiji, tell something. I know God has spoken to you. So somewhere, you know, when we are talking about sun, we are talking about the peak of spirituality, the zenith of spirituality. You know, beyond this, it is not there. Okay. So this whole thing about being God frenzy, you know, because at the same time, you know, a lot of people say, especially in these days, people fake it also. Sami Adavada, which means literally they get possessed. But the highest, the peak form of spirituality is this. That's the reason sun gets exalted in Mesharash, right? Because sun indicates the highest, the peak level of spirituality. And that's the reason you have sun who is also called as the Atma 
Karaka. Right? Atma Karaka. Next. You can write down this point. <clears throat> Guru, Koma Suryan, Koma Shani. When Grahas, many Grahas are in this Nakshatra, it qualifies for two marriages in the family. See, family is a decent way to tell. But whenever you see Chandra in Guru Nakshatra, Lagna in Guru Nakshatra, then immediately you should come to a conclusion that in this family, there are two marriages. Important rule. Write it down. Please repeat. When you have Moon or Chandra in the Nakshatras of Guru, Sun, Shani, or, or, by the way. Either the Lagna or Chandra. Then it indicates two marriages. For people in the southern part of India, Tamil Nadu, you can write Iridhara Yogam. Two marriages in the family. This yoga will be there. The in the family or for the person? In the family. You start with the family man. They will tell. See, ma'am, if the horoscope somewhere you see that, you know, first stage, you see this nakshatra. Then second, you will go. Now, I've told you this rule. Second, what will you do? When you get such horoscopes, immediately you look at the seventh bhava. Okay, this rule is also matching. First, you will see lagna in guru nakshatra. See, like that, if we see everybody who has a punarvasu nakshatra, everybody who has a purata, purva buddhrapada nakshatra, everybody who has a vishaka nakshatra, all of them should be married twice. No. First is you should understand the rule. You should understand the concept. Okay, this is there. The family it is there. Okay. Then immediately you see the horoscope. Seven bhava is weak. Oh, oh. Second rule also matches. Fine. This is how you connect. Do you get the logic, ma'am? Sir, why is it uh, Guru and Shani, sir? Guru, Kala Purusha's ninth bhava. Shani, obviously the eleventh bhava. And remember I told you this rule now? Just now I told you, right? For moon sun combination, the ninth. Ninth from ninth. Do you get it, ma'am? Yes, sir, so that I can understand for sun, but uh, Jupiter also it's the same thing. Ma'am, Jupiter. See, ma'am, you always need to understand this thing, ma'am. Jupiter is a satvic graha, right? All of that is fine, but see, ma'am, have you observed? Big, big, rich, rich people, you know, once money also comes, once dhana also comes, all this will also come automatically. And by the way, it is the Kala Purusha's ninth bhava. Ninth means what? Man? Seventh is first marriage. The vritti or the vritti sthana of marriage is the ninth. I've told this in the Graha Karakatva class also, ma'am. Guru, it signifies two marriages. Right? Great. Thank you. See, ma'am, you find one person, very rich person, very, very big person. See, in those days, it seems, you know, it was considered to be, you know what? It was considered to be a pride to have more than one wife. That means he's capable, you know, he's capable of taking care of the family, taking care of this. That's also because more dhana, all these type of things automatically happen. Okay. Right. Sir, uh, Aya, can I add one prediction? Yes, sir. Go ahead. Um, the moon sun conjunction, this person doesn't like to be touched. In the sense, if there are four or five people in one place or if they are sitting in a queue or something like that, if someone is touching them, their legs or hands mm -hmm. while crossing the line or something, they get irritated so much. Oh, oh. And the second thing is, I guess it is right or wrong. Mm. Um, they like to eat very lavish food. Okay. Mm, right. You can put that. You can put the second point. You know, what I will suggest all of you to do is first write down all the combination. You can add. See, this is like, you know what? You have this. Uh, I think it happens in all our uh, regional movies. You know, you have this Tamil movie. I'm sure it is there in Hindi movies also. Starting of the movie, they will introduce the hero. Mother would have vanished somewhere. There will be one younger brother. He would have also vanished somewhere. Father. He will be one drunkard. He would have also vanished somewhere. Right? Have you seen those type of movies? 
starting itself the hero will be separated from his entire family towards the end everybody will come back have you seen those movies do you get it hello yes. all of you so yes, this, yes. this yes. planetary combination is like that first you write down all the rules then towards the end as we move no towards the end you will get a link to everybody why everything is functioning in a certain way in your horoscope so don't worry okay lavish food you can take see moon is something to do with food so yes grand food lavish food yes the touchy thing we'll wait and watch okay go ahead anything else somebody wants to add on all of you just note down the points it's very very important because if you just give me some more time points after points i can keep telling especially when it comes to sukshamas associated with nakshatras you can go on and on like for example i will give you one more those who have dhanishta nakshatra we are talking about women especially write down right women those who are born in avittam tamil dhanishta nakshatra right it indicates hmm. yes somebody wants to interrupt write down women who have dhanishta nakshatra indicates marriage as a second wife it does not mean everybody who has a dhanishta nakshatra stree they will go as the second wife no but okay. see it does not mean every woman who has a dhanishta nakshatra they will go as a second wife but it's a very important rule especially when it comes to suggesting marriage matching why because whenever you see a girl who has a dhanishta nakshatra and when the family is planning to look out for alliances for her the first thing that you should tell is be careful while selecting the alliance because there's a lot of possibility that somebody would have already been married to somebody divorced and he will come to you as a asking as a second wife so you should give them that hint for every dhanishta nakshatra so that they are careful so that they are careful write this these are like rules that i'm telling you in between so that and while you are writing down these rules make sure that you index them number wise so that tomorrow when you are revising when you are matching horoscopes all of this will be important what happens here it is both it is both for boy and no, for no, girl no 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 ma'am i'll give you the logic behind it okay only okay. for women not for boy only and for and also sir does it apply both for the lagna and the moon nakshatra mostly the moon nakshatra ma'am but lagna also should be considered okay sir okay but warning this is a warning here why which is the mangalya sthana for a stri eight other mangalya sthana that i told you third third house where does avitta nakshatra fall in adhishta uh, makkar 10th house 10th and 11th from the third where is he third uh, eighth eighth right he starts at the eighth sorry uh, from the eighth. eighth where is he uh, third third third, third, third. third. So it's the mangalya the mangalya of the stree gets affected so automatically you should tell them again you also need to write down this rule when a dasha bhukti is operating in dhanishta nakshatra you should tell them be careful while selecting alliances this is only for a girl why because mangalya sthana here right somewhere or the other you will get an alliance they would say one looking for a second wife second wife means first wife divorced that i will give you one incident when avita nakshatra girl she got married to a military man after two months there was frequent fight then they got to know that this person was already married and he had a 8 year old child all these type of cases will happen one three is having a avita nakshatra or they will plan the marriage when you know there is a dasha bhukti of a graha in abitanakshatra means each and every 
please go on mute please go on mute see each and every nakshatra i can give you rules after rules i think yesterday or day before yesterday also a student had asked a question about punarvasu nakshatra right so you cannot find such type of things anywhere you know i'm giving you full challenge because the secret the hidden secrets to the nakshatra is only 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 with full authority i can tell you in the south down south right so much of things so much of things are there like what i told ma'am that ma'am was secrets pertaining to the punarvasu nakshatra similarly you know that we can go on and on because nakshatra siddhanta itself is a huge topic you know that will come later on one by one another thing is vishaka nakshatram those who have vishaka nakshatram lagna in vishaka nakshatram right one what will happen is in their nose in their cheeks in the face there will be a birthmark these are all simple simple sukshamas the logic behind that i will give you one by one step by step as we move on in future there will, there will be what sir birthmark ma'am face sir birthmark in the face there will be a birthmark logic i will give ma'am later on. this will come as a part of nakshatra siddhanta that will come later on ma'am first you 